The next step is the hammer lock. And we'll show that to you now. We have slow, slow, quick, quick, a release, slow to a two-end hold. I raise my hand up, hammer lock, slow, slow, quick, quick. Then we can come back together using one of our variations we showed you previously. Slow, slow, quick, quick, slow, slow, quick, quick, slow, slow, quick, quick, slow, slow, quick, quick, slow, and slow, and quick, quick. Okay, the hammer lock. We're going to break that one down for you now. All right, ladies, let's take a look at the hammer lock turn. I personally love this step because you get that twisty, windy feeling, and then you get back home to close position. So let's take a look at it. First of all, I want you to see my whole body. Then I'm going to talk about my arms, and then I'm going to talk about my feet positions. So we're going to start out in closed position, and we have slow, slow, quick, quick. The leader is going to lead us into an open position by sliding the arm down for slow, slow, quick, quick. Now we have a two-hand hold. The leader is going to turn us to the right. Now because we're turning to the right, we're going to be crossing our right foot in front and you're going to see that as I start. The other thing I want you to notice while you're looking at my full body is that I'm going to keep my left hand down, my right hand will come up to make that lovely right angle so that I don't hit him. Slow. I've made about a quarter of a turn. I'm going to make another quarter of a turn to face him, slow. And then I'm going to rock straight back with my right foot. Very small step so that I don't jolt because I do have one hand now behind my back. Quick, quick. Now, if we want to get back out of it, what's going to happen is the leader is going to bring me to turn to my left. My right hand will come in front of my face. I'll make a quarter turn, slow. I'll take another quarter turn to face him. My left hand comes out from behind my back, and then I'm in a two-hand hold, quick, quick. Now, Eldon likes to do that face loop at the end. I think it's a great ending. So what will happen is the leader draws you in, so you'll feel your hand coming up and over his head, then to his shoulder, and rock step. Now let's take a look at exactly what's going on in the upper body. So we're going to start out in our closed dance position. We have slow, slow, quick, quick. The leader rotates us to the left an eighth of a turn to face him. Slow, slow, quick, quick. Now we're in our two-hand hold. We have to remember that on this turn, only one hand will go up. It'll be our right hand. The left hand should come down. And as it comes down, you're going to feel it turning so that the palm turns outward, away from you. And what that does is it protects your arm from getting in an uncomfortable position as it moves behind your back. So how, here we go with the turn. We have slow. We're going to bring that left hand behind the back for slow and quick, quick. We're facing the leader now. To get out, he's going to bring us back, turning to our left. Make sure here that you bring that right arm elbow in front of your body for slow, making a quarter turn, then continuing to turn to face him, both hands out in front, and we rock step. To get back to close, you've got two options. You can either just go straight to close position, releasing that left hand, or the leader may choose to do that face loop. Hand goes up over his head, onto his shoulder for slow, and quick, quick. Now let's take a look at the feet. We're going to start out with our basic step for slow, slow, quick, quick. We're going to release to our two-hand hold. The leader's going to turn us slightly. Slow, slow, and notice here we're rocking straight back for quick, quick. Now we're going to start to turn. The leader will be coming behind us, so he'll actually move past our left side, and our right foot will cross in front for slow, we're going to continue to turn stepping side for slow, and I want you to take a very small back step, quick, quick. Now we're going to reverse the direction. We're going to step side on slow. We're going to take another side, making another quarter turn to face him, slow, and then we're going to rock step straight back, quick, quick. To get back home, remember that he's going to pull you in for slow. You're going to step side and slightly forward, and then you're going to rock back in an angle for quick, quick. And the reason we rock back into the angle is, remember, we've come back home to close position. Let's do it again now from another angle. I'm going to start from close position. We have slow, slow, quick, quick. He brings me to open position. Slow, slow, quick, quick. He turns me to hammerlock. Slow, slow quick, quick. He unwinds me to two-hand hold. Slow, slow, quick, quick. He brings me back to closed position. Slow, slow, quick, quick, and I'm done. Let's do it one more time from another angle. We have slow, slow, 
Two hand hold sliding down slow and hammer lock slow, slow and unwind slow. Two hands, rock step back to close position and it's rock step. This is so much fun. I really hope you'll enjoy it as you practice. Don't forget to watch it more than once. It'll help you to do it with greater confidence. We are now going to demonstrate the hammerlock turn together and give you some helpful hints. Slow, slow, quick, quick release. Slow, quick, quick. Now right here, as I raise the left hand, I also want to be turning the right hand a little bit. Let's turn so we can see that. So I'm going to be shaping it down. I'm not going to be tugging, but just shaping it so the follower feels comfortable and now I'm going to step across slow and then I'm going to allow Allison to comfortably put that arm behind her back because she knows that's where I want it to go. I don't force it. And then we rock back quick, quick, and then I raise the left hand slow, slow, quick, quick. You want to be sure, leaders, you lead with your left hand, not your right, because when the right hand is behind her back, her right hand is behind her back, it's not comfortable to be pulling. Right, Allison? That's right. It's actually very, very important. If you can remember that, leaders, you're going to have a line of ladies out the door who want to dance with you. And we want that. So let's take it from the beginning. Slow, slow, quick, quick. Release. Slow, quick, quick. I invite her with my left hand, and I let her turn in 